All right, fellas, you know the deal. If you're feeling froggy and you want to leave, make sure to go to easymud.com. The coins are stupid cheap. Make sure to use code Vic at checkout for 5% off. I love you forever. I promise. John Madden football. Look at old John. Yo, John Madden is 84 and he's worth 200 million and he's made my packs ass. I'm about to give me a ski mask. So John Madden is 84. He's worth 200 million. He's made my packs garbage. He's made me addicted to Ultimate Team. I'm gonna get my ski mask. Who I smoke? Madden. Who I smoke? Who I smoke? Ultimate Team. So thanks to this website called Madden Wiki, Wiki or Wiki, it shows me every Madden football game that has ever came out. Let's start with 1988. Look at that cover. He looked all healthy. So in the very first Madden football game, there was no NFLPA licenses, so there was no real players, stadiums, or teams. The teams were completely made up. Just look at that graphic. And look at these graphics now. We've come a long way. So I don't know if you guys have noticed it, but hopefully you have. The game title comes out like a year before like it's supposed to. I don't know why that happens for games, but um, so maybe it's a market. Thing. But as you can tell, Madden 21 came out in 2020. So this John Madden Football 88 really came out for the 87 season. And honestly, this was kind of tough. I had to do a little bit of research, but up until like 96 or 95, I have to check again. There were no real player names. So I had to go off jersey numbers and like a bunch of like weird statistics and go to the people who played during that time on these teams. So for example, in 1987, I have to go back and look to see who played in 87. In 87, the Redskins beat the Broncos. The Chargers only went eight and seven. Yo, the Seahawks was in the AFC West. There were only three divisions. And of course, number one on this list, Jerry Rice. Jerry Rice had 22 touchdowns. All right, boys, first up is Jerry Rice. This OG ass sellout. The next football game, John Madden Football 1990. You can tell he's getting a little old. So on Madden 90, they actually added the teams. They didn't have the players yet, though. It was only the teams. Like, bro, look at these graphics, dude. Lawrence Taylor, ooh-wee. <laughs> he's the second player, 1990. John Madden Football. 92. Okay, so apparently they didn't add the full team names. I think they just did the cities and colors. Because right there it says that and they, there were a total of 29 teams including a bonus all Madden team. Oh, look at the new features. Instant replay, weather conditions, two-player co-op. This is how the game was set up. This guy says best football game ever made. That's not it. So once again for 1992, I gotta look up a player that played in the 91-92 season. I'm looking at none of these guys are in Madden. <laughs> Let's go to the Bills. They lost. I think this is the time they lost like four Super Bowls or three. Okay, so they got Thurman Thomas and Andre Reed, but neither one of them are in Madden. Let's just go to random teams. Okoye, but he's not in Madden, of course. All right, so the Chargers, we went, God damn, we went four and 12? Jeez. Our quarterback was John Freezy. Oh, Junior Seau. I'll take Junior Seau for this team. Junior Seau, oh my goodness, rest in peace. To a legend going way too soon. John Madden Football 93. He gaining a little weight now. He's sitting in that booth eating chicken. So there's no bio for 93. Are those Clay Thompson shoes? Bro, you can buy this game for $6. Look at this game, bro. This game got a 5.1 out of 10. Ed McCaffrey, goal 99 with only 96 speed. <laughs> I don't know why I chose Ed McCaffrey. He was the only player I could really find that was in Madden around that time. Madden NFL 94. Once again, the NFL Players Association license has not yet been granted to EA. Thus, the roster still use generic names for the NFL players. Okay, they added a coin toss. Oh, they got a nice little opening scene now in 94. They added a kicking meter. Damn, he got cleaned up. <laughs> But once again, they do not have the names. It's just numbers. Madden 94, we get the 95 Larry Allen, the big beast with like 99 speed. All right, he doesn't have 99 speed, but he can catch your ass if you wanted to. Madden 1995, the first year they gave the NFLPA license to EA so they could have the name of the players in the game. A step towards greatness. There was a Madden 95 strategy guide. But once again, there's no way I can find the players other than going on like the pro football reference. Big John Randall, 296 one. I don't know how he has 85 speed, but probably because he could chase your ass down too. Look at that smile. Madden 96, the year I was born. It's the first game to be developed by Tiburon. There was a cheat code booked in Madden 96. 15 second quarters, view the Super Bowl win screen. Imagine if you could do this now. Rod Woodson, one of the greatest corners. One of the greatest players. It was only right to put him on this team. Madden 97, the first one on PlayStation. PlayStation 1, not PS2, 3, 4, 5, PlayStation 
one. Real OGs. Like the video if you had an original Xbox or original PlayStation. This is back when there was no HDMI. It was red, yellow, white. You had to plug it in the back of the TV. Look at this improvement of gameplay already. Even though it's like a minor step, this is a pretty decent step in, in, in uh, Madden. And also, this makes it a whole lot easier because the names on here. He has Aikman. This is around the time that Rod Woodson played for the Steelers. I can't build this type of team without mentioning this guy in this team. So for 1997, Neon, Dion, Primetime Sanders. It's not a Madden team, or at least an all Madden team without Dion being on it. I believe Dion is the greatest NFL player ever. Madden 98, once again, there's no bio. Graphics are getting a little bit better. This game might actually be playable. And <laughs> uh, what was this, 1998? I was two years old. Didn't know what the f I didn't know how to shit yet. Look, they thought that was innovative by adding in this little virtual kind of coin toss thing. All right, you guys know the rules. We had to get a lineman. Yeah, I know. Uh, calm down, calm down. Madden 99. Okay, this is the last one before we start getting into the 2000s. Dog, for some reason, I remember playing this. No, it might not have been this one because I was only three. But look, I remember these big blocky characters, dog. Back to back linemen. Yeah, kill me. Brother, this yeah, guy linemen. I, I have to have them, okay? Relax. I have to have them. Madden 2000. This game was released for the first time on Game Boy Color, PC, and MacBook. But as you can see, the gameplay is relatively the same as the previous Madden games for the past four years. That's how we feel now. Fullback, okay, I get it. Three straight off the climbing, pretty much. Yeah, I know. Relax. I just. I have to get these out the way, I'm sorry. 2001, we started getting into the player covers. And this is the first PlayStation 2 version. So this is the play call of me. This, this is clunky, oh my God. All right, boys, so this was uh, peak Madden 01 gameplay. <laughs> now I could have went with Eddie George, but I'm gonna go with his teammate on the other side of the ball. The greatest rookie of all time, Javon Kirsch. And I know Eddie George was cover, but like I said, I want to go with his teammate, Javon Kirsch, because I want to say that running back spot. Madden 02 with Dante Culpepper. Yeah, why they got my shoes on here? I just got these. FBI agent, stop. D tackle, um, look at his eyes. You can tell he was on that stuff. I think he like had sex with a prostitute and then slapped her or something. It was crazy. He also did crack. I joke about it, but he did it, I think. 03 with Marshall Falk. Al Michaels and Pat Summerall was the commentators, and they had their first EA tracks. These artists, nobody would know of nowadays. Where's the NBA young boy? Where's the gunner? Where's the young thug? Little baby. The gap, no more. He actually got his, his smile fixed. He no longer has the gap. This is the Michael Strahan I remember. Not the new one with the with the fresh cuts and, and the nice teeth and all that. That ain't Michael Strahan. Oh my God. This game right here. 04, Michael Vick on the cover. The greatest athlete a video game has ever seen. Debate with your father, your mother, your grandmother, your grandfather, your uncle, your aunts. This is the greatest athlete to ever touch a video game. So I think it's very obvious who I'm going with right here. The greatest video game athlete of all time to touch. The grace of our fingertips and controlling players, Michael <laughs> Vick. Holy Madden 05 with the killer on the cover. I think it's very obvious who my choice is. Ray Lewis got away with murder and still played a full NFL career. Madden 2006, I think this was the first time it was on 360. You can already tell it was a crazy upgrade in graphics. The, the play call screen is way better. The players actually look like players. They're not just building blocks. They're actually moving their feet and their legs. <laughs> like this is actual players. For Madden 06, we had a couple 99 players, Peyton Manning, John Ogden, Ray Lewis, and then Randy Moss. That's an easy choice. The greatest receiver of all time, Randy Moss. All you little Jerry Rice nut huggers, Lee, Randy Moss is the greatest of all time. Him and Calvin Johnson, debate your moms or your dads, but don't debate me. 07 with Sean Alexander on the cover. New features with the highlight stick. I don't remember what that is. And then NFL superstar. Oh my God, that was so fun. 07 features some more, you know, not on overall players, but this time I'm doing Ed Reed. One of, if not the greatest safety of all time. He could hit, he could cover, he could tackle, he could do everything. He knew the plays before you ran him. Bill Belichick avoided him. That's all I have to say. Madden 08 was the birth of the hit stick. Now obviously Madden 08 the cover athlete was Vince Young, but a part of the 99 overall club is Peyton Manning, and then you see that the greatest of all time, LT, the best running back of all time, LT. I don't care what you say. He's the greatest of all time. He won MVP. Just look at the stats, bro. 13,145 touchdowns. And you can't even name one lineman he had to block for. I'll wait. 
Cause you can't. Look at old Brett Favorite. I remember this game, fun story. I had this game on Wii, but I forgot to pay for it. You know, you, you, you know, you know what I did. It's unfortunate. I was young. I was young. I was dumb. We've all done that before, whether it was this game or a bag of chips or some candy. We've all done it before. Madden 09. I'm actually gonna use two players. And then two of my favorite players ever. So in 2009, I'm gonna choose two players. The first one is Darrell Revis. Revis Island, the goat of his time. You went to Revis Island, you were stuck. And then we got Billy Bob Sanders. Now, this guy was one of the greatest players that could never reach his potential because he was always hurt. He always injured himself and I hate it. 2010, this was the first year ever that they put two players on the cover. This is that Super Bowl that was crazy. Harrison had that crazy pick six and I still believe Larry Fitzgerald would have caught him if that dude wasn't in his way in the sideline. Holmes had the crazy catch. That was a great game. I finally realized his feet touched the ground. It took me years to realize that I didn't believe it. His feet hit the ground, it was a catch. A rare name, Namdi Asamoah was a 99 overall on the Raiders. I think this was the year before he robbed the Eagles. Namdi before he robbed the Eagles. That boy was a beast. And now Eagles fans hate him. <laughs> Drew Brees, the New Orleans God. He's out, he's retired now, but Madden 11, this is one of the greatest Maddens that I remember playing. Now, I've already got a quarterback, so there's really no point in me actually getting another quarterback. If not, I would've went with Drew Brees. But from this one, Patrick Willis was a 9-on overall. And the one thing I hated was Patrick Willis only played for a short amount of time. I feel like Willis could've played for at least five or six more years. But he was smart and got out of the game by his choice and not by force. Patrick Willis, this guy, man, oh man. I wish Evan Bowman could have played like three more years. Madden 12, I bet you can't name who this is. I'll give you three seconds. Okay, it's Peyton Hillis. He had like one great year and then that was it. Peyton Hillis in 2011 had 500 yards. How was he the cover athlete? Once again, another GOAT, greatest tight end of all time. Gates stands for greatest at tight end. I don't know what the S stands for. Greatest at tight end, S. Madden 13, this was peak. Ultimate Team. I don't think we'll ever touch Madden 13 Ultimate Team, ever, like ever. This was around Madden 13, MW2 I think was out, MW2 or, or Call of Duty 4, one of the two. These were the only two games I played for like non-stop, like eight hours a day, coming home after school. I didn't do no homework. We had time for homework when I had to grind MW2 to get my 10 prestige, and then Madden 13, I had to do the Combine Warrior Collection. Oh my God, I'm gonna lose my about this game. Matter 13, it's obvious who I'm picking from this one. If it wasn't for Andy Moss, Calvin, you'd be the best, man. Played with Stafford and the Lions for, for 10 years. I feel bad for you, but you were a beast. Madden 25, this is actually the next gen version of the PS4, but on the 360 version, Barry Sanders is on the cover. All right, Madden 25, I got me a backup running back. Barry Sanders, you know, he's solid. He's not LT, but he's solid. Madden 15, the Legion of Boom was on the closing screen. And now Byron Maxwell is nowhere to be found. Legion of Boom era, Sherman on the Seahawks. Damn, that was a crazy time. They bullied the Broncos in the Super Bowl. I thought it was fixed. Whoo! So in 2015, Madden Mobile came out. This shit was trash. Yo, why are all my shoes I want popping up right here? Madden 60, Odell Beckham single-handedly ruined this game. I don't care what anybody says. The aggressive catching bullshit was at an all-time high. Honestly, if I didn't have to fill out this lineup with like offensive linemen and stuff like that, I would have went Odell Beckham. But this is one of the last years that Joe Thomas played, so I gotta respect Joe. Salute to Joe Thomas and having one of the greatest linemen careers of all time. He set the record for most career snaps in a row. Never lost. Joe Thomas is the greatest left tackle of all time. And if you remember this Zedarius Smith card, you are a for real OG. Zeus or Zedarius Smith as most of you know him as. I know him as Zeus back in Madden 16. His card in Madden 16, you could get like eight of them and put them all on D-line and he just destroyed the game. Think of having like a 99 Lawrence Taylor when your best offensive lineman is like an 88. That's how he was. Madden 17 with Gronk as the cover athlete. This is around the time I really started doing YouTube and like taking it seriously. This was one of the first years that a replacements, the first years of theme teams, and this was the first year that I met Matt. This was the thought version of Matt. Bro, this is when PAX was so f Man, this was so fun open packs, right, bro? Rob Gronk. The Gronk spike is legendary. I just wish he wasn't on the Patriots, man. I would love him if he wasn't on the Patriots. Madden 18 with Tom Bitch ass Brady on the cover. This is the first time they put Long Shot in here. The thing that nobody plays after a week. In this 99 club is Aaron Donald. It's not an all mad team without one of the greatest D linemen of all time. He's like top three, maybe top two. Unguardable, unblockable. Madden 19 with Clown Brown on the cover. Boy, 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 did that curse hit him hard. Quentin Nelson. I actually got this guy because he's one of the 
great young lineman in the league. And I, I actually like this guy. And he blocked for Phillip for a year. I love him for that. Madden 20. The first year they introduced all the superstar abilities, X factors and all that stuff. I still think that ruins Madden. Darwin James is the best Madden playing football player in the league. He's proven it. He's played like everybody. He beats him by like 55 points. It was only right I put him in here. He's also one of the best safeties too. And this year, Madden 21. I don't know if it's obvious who I'm picking, but uh, yeah, it, it might be obvious. <laughs> It was only right. Even though I might not play with him, it's only right. Herbert represents Madden 21 and the future going forward. All right, boys, so this is a squad fully built and fully powered up. Well, not powered up, but chemmed up and abilityed up. This is a good ass team. Defensively, we look really good, bro. Like, we look crazy good. Oh, this is gonna be fun. What's poppin'? Play action, boom. Nobody's getting open. But circle is, circle is. What the? Go up the field, go up the field. Ed, Ed, go up, Ed. Never mind, I got gates. I got gates, get down. Let's go. Up the field, R1. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. <gasps> no, 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 get it, thank you. Joe Thomas. I'm gonna just run, you know, nope. Sauce, sauce, sauced. Ah, oh, man, nobody. Block 75. What the f waiting for a Happy Meal? Oh man, up the field, R1. Circle, 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 circle. Oh my God, oh my God. That was a, hey, hey, that's a punt, that's a punt, that's a punt. I, I, it was kind of a punt. I'm locking you up, bump. Got him, clamps. Oh my God, I was guarding the wrong person. Oh, get, get him, go get him, go get him, go get him. And then he's open. Oh my God, he making me look soft. Oh my God, dude, X, yep. <gasps> okay, okay, I didn't know what you were doing that right there at first. Keep going, keep going, keep going, yep. Got him, you should get struck him. Oh, oh, don't fumble him. Oh, triangle, yep. Oh, right there, Gates. Get over so I can play the ball. Got him. Get him. Yo! I snapped you on my damn collar, bruh. X. Oh, he's got him. Come here, Gates. Herbo getting involved. Yes. Herbo getting involved. Look at them. Look at them high knees. Kelsey was too fast for me last time. Okay, that dude's on that route. Oh, yeah. That ain't gonna work no more, buddy. He needs 22 yards. But we give him 22 yards, but we might as well just chalk it. Got him. Got him. Somebody go up the field. Somebody go. Triangle. Triangle, LT, let's go. You're not, nope, psych, you thought. Let's go, man, let's go. Oh, I'm on D-line again, get to him. Get, yo, we getting after him now. Yeah, no, I'm on D-line, oh, I suck on the wrong time. Wow, Asamoa, Asamoa. This is that Eagles Asamoa, man. Oh, wait a minute, no, I, Bro, I, was, I, I couldn't see the buttons, man. The dude in the middle of the field was wide open, bro. Strip him, strip him, strip him, strip him, strip him. Damn it. Hey, Dion, come make that tackle. Huh? Make him waste time, make him waste time. Make him waste, yes! No, no, let him get us out. <laughs> you played yourself. Bro, as long as you don't get beat on that side, I'm good. Let's go. Sack. You cannot protect against this, dude. All right, I'm going to stop cheesing because apparently that was way, that was way too overpowered. All right, let's go. We still got pressure, dude. Kurt has four. He's really going for this, dude. It's fourth and 27. And he got sacked again. Calvin Johnson, I'm looking for you, bro. I'm looking for you, Calvin. Get open. I'm throwing this to Calvin, regardless. I don't even fuck. Oh, man, that was the worst throw ever, bro. Mm, he's throwing it to the running back. Running back, running back, running back. Give me the him. Give me the him. You can let go so many places. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Everybody eats, B. Okay, 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 okay. Ha, got him. You got him. You're not catching me, Gilmore. You're not catching me. You're not, no. No more of that scramble. Nope. Come on now. You just, you just threw that. You literally just threw that. And then you throw it again. I'm gonna pitch you back in the third one. I got like two pick sixes. He's only throwing to this running back. Or getting sacked. I never get pressure like this. And now I'm getting it like, oh my God. I just wanted to know how many sacks I had. All right, boys, solid game, solid video, solid squad builder. If you have any other ideas of theme teams you want me to build, let me know now before the bad season ends so I can book a quarter and you guys can get them ASAP. But this is your boy Vic. Drop a like if you enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. But